Hello everyone, this is Daniel, and um, let's talk uh, some politics and let's talk about God, what he thinks about what's going on with America. So you know the thing about Afghanistan was really horrendous, right? And removing the troops from Afghanistan was in part done by doing, you know, by doing that, he just let the Taliban do whatever they wanted because he let them out in such a hurry that Taliban, ISIS, and everyone else that was there, like the terrorist state and a, like a terror center, really was, you know, fine and let the terrorists do whatever they want. And it's horrible what he did because he, it's not really all his fault, but it is his fault, by the way, but it's not all his fault. He is to blame. So let's, let's continue. So... By doing that, by letting that, which he's mainly involved with this, was he's let the terrorists do, like go after America and all the other allies. And let me tell you what that in doing that is doing, you know, just getting all get getting rid of the military, <clears throat> getting all the troops out, and letting the Taliban and ISIS do the horrible deeds. By doing that, letting the other enemy nations do some horrible deeds and do attacks on the allies is actually treason. Yes, what Biden did was treason. And let me tell you why. I told you before that if he, leave, if he lets the troops out and they leave and abandon, which is abandonment, and abandon basically our allies to be um, under attack by like enemy nation and an enemy military it's like making our ally not and like like making our ally an, an enemy and just doing that is causing other allies to be attacked by ISIS and the Taliban which is basically it's like military um treason because they're the ones they're that are enemies and we're letting them do whatever they want by abandoning the military bases so anyway, Biden is not all to blame, but he is the center. He's the center of attention. However, the person really involved with this, the person that caused the military to leave and caused Afghanistan to be the way it is, he should be the main result of treason. He should be a, he should be arrested for treason, not just to cause all the horrible things in the world in the future, but seriously, if he's to consider what he did, that would be treason. Letting enemies have our weapons is treason. That's number one. Letting the enemies do whatever they want with our with their with our planes and everything that they they that that, that, that they can their, get their hands on is treason. Letting them attack nations with our weapons, and our and our um, nation and friend and, and our friendly nations, our uh, allies, is a third reason. And you don't think that treason is a serious thing when it comes down to that, but really, treason is an act to let our enemies attack everyone, well as well as attacking our, you know, allies. So just getting ourselves involved with having us be involved with the attacks of our uh, friendly nation, our an allies, by attack by letting the enemies do with that is treason. So in short, Biden and the person that got involved with getting our troops out is treason. And I'm sorry, but this is the truth. Because Biden has his dirty hands now. And if he does have Alzheimer's, then let him have his share in the um, group home. Let, let them have his share in the <clears throat> assistant living. You know what I mean, right? Let him share, have his share in assistant living just so we can have him just, you know, not do anything else to harm this nation. 
But the person that got involved with getting rid of the troops in Afghanistan, abandoning, abandoning all of our weapons and aircraft and all that, helicopters, you know. You know what I mean, right? He should be the one that is going to prison and maybe getting the death sentence. Because that's how serious treason is. Now the Taliban and ISIS are going to plot the attacks, like 9-11. Probably not ex exactly as bad, but just think of it. Uh, just think about that. You know, the Taliban is capable of doing 9/11 attacks, and that's how bad this treason is. Because once they have established their own nation as the Taliban nation, an ISIS nation, and a terrorist state, and a terrorist nation, all disasters will break loose. All tax will break loose. Misery will be the thing that America will face and every other um, ally nation. Because if you think about it, our allies are the targets of um, the Taliban and ISIS. Not only that, our ally nation is Israel. And they're going to go after like a no tomorrow. So just remember that, okay? Just remember that by going after our allies, even places like London, that's what they're going to do. They're going to go after Germany, London, England, things like that. Even worse, it's America's fault and it's where I live. Well, anyway, I'll be done, okay? Bye.